Sergio Studios. Extra. Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Sergio Dominguez with another animation look through. And this one is the Sergio Show episode 84. Wow, this is actually one of my favorite episodes of the show because this is where I meet the evil vending machine. And I did an audio commentary for the episode if you want to check that out. But so for this episode, let's just take a look at some animation moments in this episode. Now, so the first thing I want you to sh to to show you this. Now, obviously, when when I used to do this intro, it'd be the sign. And if you notice how the there's square edges here, these little it has like an edge here. That's because there's another Sergio Show logo behind this that's off aligned, and I did not notice it for a long time. So that's why it doesn't look like a, a proper square. And and another thing I want to also talk about is that um, yeah, the camera would zoom out from logo to the desk but because since the desk had so many materials it'd be so much to animate with meaning this set like this with a lot of drawing layers would crash and would be too much for the software to handle at the time so what we would do is have this be an actual still image and you can notice when I do this mm -hmm. there you notice this to this this frame is from the intro, and this frame is a still image of that previous frame, but you know, brought in and resized to fit here. So that's why it looks like that. So that's why it has that little, uh, yeah, varied uh, stretch for one frame pop. Another mistake I made is, is the animation pegs. The oval one's the middle and the circle ones are the side. No, it's the circle one in the middle and the oval ones on the sides. My gosh, I rectify it later, but my gosh. So here I am introduced. So, oh, look, another one of those mistakes oh, that I mentioned a couple of times before. Nothing under here. And oh, through this leaf. Oh, still a lot to learn, even in season. What is it? Season nine? Season nine. <laughs> I don't do the lip sync. So, but it still manages to be a great episode and fun to watch. Whoop. That circle effect. So that's okay. Still haven't, I, I would improve on my walk cycles here. Like this would be rigged on, rigged later on. And uh, yeah, there would be some bend and a little bit more of a hop to it. Ah, uh, this big boy. Oh man, even in this form, it's very nice. At this time, I was, this was 2012 or so. No, 2013. I made it in 2012, but it came out 2013. And I was just figuring out this thing in Toon Boom that I called Gradient. You know, one color easing into the other color. And I wanted to do it with the vending machine, so. Yeah, th this was a nice thing. I first drew this, and then I outlined it digitally. That's why it doesn't look that refined like this is too thick and this and this is not centered and all that stuff but it still manages to be a very nice looking prop even in not uh, final form mm -hmm. me bang on this is pretty good if it has not enough weight to it if it goes back that much with a bang that's hilarious the timing on this could be better like yeah, it should have been a little bit more slower. And also there's an, a frame of a pop. Up oh, there. Oh, 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 my gooseness. But oh well, that's fine. So as we continue on. Oh, that claw arm was just like a scoopy hand. Yeah, I never had a plug, so I just off camera did a plug. Boop. Um, but shut off or is it is it shut off oh oh it's transformed like whoop. the arm came, came in from the back it goes up and it's after me <laughs> now i want it to be a repeated cycle and i was like oh, let me add more than just the just the wall so i put random pipes and literally wrote it the running uh the, the, the frames could have been better yeah doesn't look like he's running more like fast walking with the legs wide, but eh, it's still got the job done. Even here, walking upstairs real fast is like, so, so I just think I did steps and just had the peg go here and here. Yep. I tried. Really tried with this one. 
Lighting is just solid black line with a light here. A lot of things to improve, but it's still a good episode. Very good. Now this upcoming shot had to add a lot of detail. Look at all that detail. I'm trying to give out the exposition of all these things. <laughs> uh, very funny. I just want to add all the cliches on how it can be evil. This was a difficult shot. This was complicated. Because I wanted to go through the door here and around the neck. I'm like, how do I do that? I don't think at the time I learned about the masking tool. So I think everything was in its own layer. Like a layer here, layer here. Yeah, especially when the door had to break. And had to be over the neck too. Yeah, there was like, like a way I layered it. Especially when everything comes apart. Like right here, see all one chunk? Yeah. I think I layered it and I just put certain parts in the back and some in the front. Oh, there was no mask at all. This is also fun right here. Bo, 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 bo. Oh, oh, oh. It was like I wanted to just have them slide down. Like, boom, 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 boom. You know, I wish there was more impact because it is like two solid drawings just, just bumping down the stairs, but I mean, it's okay. And even the stairs look so lightweight because it's so thin. So I get up. He gets up too. I think it was too sudden a cut. Mm, boom, yeah. This is a nice long-winded speech about friendship. We'll pass by that. I'll just have arm gestures with this one. Oh, friendship. You think, oh, he's going to be nice. There comes this funny animation sequence. Boom, 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 boom. Classic cartoon thing of being flopped around. Boom, boom. Yep. Thanks. Uh, uh, uh. I was just animating to my dialogue to do this. When I go in, uh, I just animate going, uh. When I go in, uh, I animate that going, uh. So that's why it was like that. This... Was last second. Uh, I put out one gun, another gun, but I'm like, mm, I want to put one more gun and let it be in the mouth just for fun gag. Here it comes. Blah. Too quick of a cut, but still, it's funny. I just, I just quickly animated, hand drawn, animated a tongue for one frame, another frame, another frame, another frame, another frame, and there you go. This gun and my tongue going blah. Even though it doesn't appear later in the shot, it was just there to be a last second joke. Like, mm, let that just be two guns. There'll be a third gun in the mouth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I wanted to replay with what's up, but since his head is also the torso, I animated like this. Yo, what's up? Yeah, what's up? <laughs> yeah, what's up? Then there's a nice line of just me saying stuff, which is like... Oh, Cheap uh, uh, action catchphrases, too. That's what it is. Just cheap action catchphrases. This was a fun sequence because I didn't... The challenge here was I didn't know how to animate the character falling apart. So these dents, I actually just colored in the same color as the wall. That's the trick. It's the same color as the wall. I just painted over the, a layer of it. So instead of... That's how it breaks. Yeah, I just drew that. I drew blue over on top of it or a layer over it to like bend the blend into the background to make it look like it's breaking. Then other layers of like cracks, they appear a frame at a time here and here. That one didn't work and move properly. See the arm, the, the animation of that arm flowing off is fun. I see it was like, like a little hurricane. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And dies. For now. I th another problem I had was I didn't time this well. This going to me. There to me. It was supposed to be a lot slower to go with the, the tension calming music. And then it would cut off with me finally getting my chips. And there we go. 
And that's it for my animation looking through the episode number 84, one of my favorite episodes. It came out really well. It still holds up well. Just a little, little bit of animation problems that would improve over time. But um, still a fun episode. I still love looking at it and laughing and just seeing how well it was put together at the time. A lot of things to learn and things that I would expand upon later on. But this is one of the episodes that helped me get through it. And you know what? I just want to thank you for... Just looking through this episode 2 of episode 84 of The Sergio Show. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And follow me on social medias and comment down below. And all that wonderful stuff if you can, please. Thank you. Again, I am Sergio Dominguez saying have an animated day. Thank you.